Zimbabweans across the country are waiting with bated breath for the outcome of the Zimbabwe Defense Forces ZDF's move to weed out criminals within ZANU-PF and their negotiations with President Robert Mugabe. Currently at Bulawayo City Hall online desk the crowd giving army food and alcohol. Nuwansora says, Zimbabwe is not for one person, army has upheld constitution, Zim is for all races. Her hold on power Mugabe has come to an end he quotes what Jesus said on the cross in his last moments. China Masa, says he is representing ZANU-PF and is immediately booed, Mahia had to intervene to bring order so that he is allowed to speak. Chanting crowds demand the return of USD ask China Masa where it went. The minister has torrid time addressing the rest of crowd he says war veterans fought to remove Mugabe and should be respected. He says Mugabe must go he has to resign. People around Mugabe should be arrested, their crimes should be investigated Mugabe should go now Joyce Mujuri is introduced just says I am here to support war vets, says people have suffered enough. Let's all push so that he goes Pastor Mawarir comes on stage says let's build Zimbabwe together. Building a new opportunity for the people. Not a party issue, this is a Zimbabwe thing shouts Mawarir. Patson Zamara Gate crashed and demands the whereabouts of his brother Opa Muchingori denounces First Lady and says we have capacity to solve our own problems. Tells off SADC and says we have to march to State House to remove the tyrant. Roads congested but everything flowing perfectly well in the absence of police. Watch live video of what is currently going at Parliament HTTPS www.newsday.co.swow Content uploads 2017-11 WhatsApp video 2017118 at 12.12.24.mp4 We are giving an ultimatum to Mugabe. This aura, this pretense that things are normal going to Zimbabwe Open University capping people, it's pretense, Chris Mavangwa war veterans have called on cornered President Robert Mugabe to step down today or face the wrath of Zimbabweans in a planned final push rally to oust the only leader Zimbabwe has known since independence in 1980. Currently at Bulawayo City Hall.